Hey guys. Okay, so after taking the license to school, I did not just drop her off and come back home and do nothing. I actually had a pretty productive day. Um, my sister goes. My sister's kids go to the same school as my kid, so um, she helped me out with some errands today, such as money order for the rent, and then. She took me out shopping to get some essentials that I needed for the bathroom. Um, I had done a previous and central run yesterday with my other sister because she came to visit. She took me to do the um, other errands I had, um, which included like trash bags and some light cleaning supplies. And um, I got all of the Lysa's hair needs, which I show in the morning. And um, that same brand, I have on her the same shampoo and conditioner brand. So she has those. Um, and then today, I just had a couple more errands to do, and then I did a little bit of personal shopping, I guess you can say. So I just wanted to show you guys a little, like, um, I guess, like, mini shopping haul type thing. And then from, like, a little bits of every kind of store. So first, we had gone to the 99... No, we had gone to Target, actually. Because uh, I was planning to go to Daiso first, but it was closed until 10. So we did a little Target run. Obviously, after our coffee run, so my sister was kind enough to buy me Starbucks. So we got some Starbucks first, and then we went to Target, and then they came across this cute jar. Oh my gosh, I love it so much, you guys. So I grind my coffee beans from time to time. Um, it's not an all-time thing. It's like rarely, but I'm in the mood <laughs> for some raw beans. Well, I don't know if that's the proper word. Anywho. I saw this on the little dollar section that they have when you enter. I'm not sure if every Target is the same, but my Target, when you first enter, it has the little dollar section. I call it the dollar section. I am not sure what the proper section is called or referred to as, but I call it the dollar section. So everything's like between five and under, or I think also ten dollars is the highest it goes, but I've only seen five dollar items and under. So this happened to be within the five dollar item, and it's just. A jar. It says it's a bath salt jar, but I'm going to use it for my coffee once I grind it. Um, my coffee ground, I guess you can call it. And I love the lid. The lid is attached to this, so it just hangs. And then it came with a spoon inside. Oh my god, this is what got me the spoon. If it, if it did not have the spoon at all, I would have never gotten it. And it was $5, so that's a win. And it's glass, too. <laughs> it's glass, so I fell in love with this. And I think that was the only thing I had gotten from Target. My goal was to get straws from Target, but their straws were not in stock, so I didn't get any straws at all. And then after our Target run was the 99 cent store. So I got a couple of things from there. And um, the things I got were uh, more like essential things. So I got this deodorant for Ricky. He said he needed a deodorant. I had asked them yesterday if he needed something, and so today I got him his deodorant. Um, it's whatever they had. Usually he uses, um, I think, what's that red label? Is it called Old Spice? I'm not really sure what the brand is, to be honest, but he uses that brand that uses a lot of red on it, and but he gets the lavender one. I forget what brand it is. Anyway, but I got him a degree because that's the best one they had there. And then um, I also got the shower curtain. Um, when I was getting this, me and my I was so confused. I told my sister, I didn't know you can clean these. I didn't know they were reusable or washable, I guess you can say. Because I was reading it and then it said, um, what did it say? What does it say? Oh, it said easy to clean. And I've never seen that on the previous one. So I've just been buying them, letting it get nasty, and then throwing it out and then buying a new one. Which, obviously, <laughs> I have a new one. And so, now that it said it's easy to clean, you just wipe it down with a damp cloth, and I never done, I never thought to do that ever. So, I'm going to see how that goes. I'm going to save myself a lot of money <laughs> from throwing them out and then keeping it. So, that's awesome. I'm going to start wiping it down with a damp cloth after a shower so that all that water stain doesn't get stuck. Or I'm not sure how it's going to go, but I am ready to try that as to save money. So, I'm going to be cleaning this and reusing it. Um, and then I didn't have, I used to have a sponge, make a sponge, and it got so dirty I never cleaned it so I tossed it out. And so I saw this $1.99 for three, so I didn't think that was a bad price. And then it has a little tiny one, which is awesome because 
I use concealer under my eyes and I don't and it's like I have deep corners I guess you can say so this is gonna help with the deep corners and with the nose creases too so that's awesome I'm sorry I had to sneeze Ugh. sorry so I got myself some of these and I never ever ever bought myself lashes but this is the first time I also the Nana sister and I got myself some lashes and then I got this it was between this cat eye feathery one but then I asked my sister and she it was um, we both chose the feathery natural curl for me and my sister's a lash artist but at the moment she's a little expensive for me. <laughs> oh, she actually has reasonable, reasonable prices. It's just I'm too broke. I am a broke bitch at the moment. Okay, so I got myself some nine nice and store lashes because I love my eyes with lashes. So we're gonna see how this one goes. And I thought it came with glue for the lashes, but apparently it doesn't. I even called my sister, uh, my other little sister, and because she used to buy like lashes all the time, and she was like, "No, you need to buy your own glue." And I was like, "Dang." So. This is gonna have to wait for a while. <laughs> I'm not sure how long, but we'll see how this goes. Um, never have I worn lashes like this, but I have worn like, um, like the I'm not really sure what you call them like semi permanent lashes that last you for like two weeks or so. Because my sister does them and I used to pay for them, but then, like I said, I'm a broke bitch now, so can't afford it right now at the moment. Um, and then after the 99 cents store, oh, I also got some cotton swabs. We didn't have any more for like two months, so I got some cotton swabs. And um, and then I went to Daiso, and at Daiso I just got a few things. So I, Eliza got a new backpack yesterday, and I usually like putting like, sorry, my cat's open. Window. Oh, okay. Anywho. Um, I usually like putting like a name tag on her and I didn't have a name tag so I bought her like just a random tag like and I saw, I thought this one was so cute because she loves kitties and it's a bear just as a kitty eating fish. So at the back of it I'm just going to use permanent black sharpie for um, her name and I'm also going to put it on this just in case they can't see it on this dark brown so I'm just going to also put her name on the pink part of the band so this is for her backpack. And then I have a chore chart for the Lysa. I think in one of my previous vlogs, you guys see me trying to fix it up so that I don't have to keep erasing the borderlines. But the tape was too thick, so I kind of did it differently. But then my sister helped me pick out like some really thin tape um, to use for the borders for her chore chart. So I'm going to be doing it um, probably tonight or tomorrow morning um, or something. I'll, I'll probably end up doing it tomorrow in the morning when she goes to school so that I can have time. Um, so I got her some masking tape for the border of her chore charts. And then I had other things on my list to buy but I couldn't find a single thing that I had on my list which were not essentials. It was more of like I guess person, personal item shopping. So because I couldn't find the other ones that I kind of wanted for myself and the house um, I ended I came across this yoga mat it was so cute they had three different ones I forgot what the first one was but I know it was this pink one which is a bunny I don't know if it has a bunny face I haven't opened it yet but um, I found this one and I wanted they had one that was the panda and the color was cream and I really 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 wanted that one but it was eight dollars and this one was 525 as you guys can see it's 525 so I kind of went more with the um, the budget friendly one so I got the three dollar less or two fifty dollar less than the regular mat so yes I'm gonna open it tomorrow tomorrow I'll show you if it has the bunny face when you come out of school okay <laughs> tomorrow you have early day anyway so you'll be home early tomorrow okay okay I will um as I was saying um I don't know if it has a bunny face and if it does it'll be so cute and I got this for um, working out because I did start working out about a month ago, but because I, ha I have carpet floor and um, oh, these pets, you guys, oh my gosh, I cannot, like the floor just felt dirty and because I haven't shampooed the carpet in like, I think two months. So it's like seriously time for me to shampoo the carpet and the only reason it's been two months is because I did not have any cleaning supplies and usually I use detergent because you know carpet is fabric so 
I use detergent to shampoo the carpet and I did not have detergent for that long. So um, tomorrow that's on my list to do. Uh, but I've been feeling, just, I just felt too dirty to even work out at home. So I have not worked out. I have not continued that routine that I started. And so, you know, for $5, why not? You know, now I have nothing in my way mentally to ex as an excuse for myself. Let me finish. As an excuse for myself. And um, so, yeah. So hopefully this actually keeps me on track of what I want to do. So, um We'll see how that goes. Um, I don't know if it's going to start tomorrow or the next day, but we'll see. And I mean, because I'm adding it to a new routine that I'm not used to. So, and then, yeah. So we'll find out tomorrow if it has a little bunny face on it or not. So we went to Costco. I had a Costco certificate um, for a cost. People who have cost. Blah, blah, blah. Those who have Costco memberships, uh, you guys will know that you guys like money back certificate type check thing. So I had one for $38 and um, so I bought Delisa a cute little outfit. I, so you guys saw that she came behind me. She's wear, That's the outfit I bought her. It's a Puma outfit and I also came with a sweater but she's not wearing it. Um, but it's, it was such a cute outfit. So I got her that outfit and then I got myself these cute um, jogger pants. And this is my favorite color you guys. Green. This green. Is my favorite color you know like anything within this type of dark or even darker is within my favorite green color and I'm just gonna show you guys the picture so that you guys can see what it's supposed to look like and tomorrow I'm gonna try them on tomorrow I don't know if it focused or not you guys let me just focus it for you guys again uh, right there. so that's the jogger pants in the back and then it has a front view so this is the front view of the jogger pants there you go that's how it's supposed to look. And these are just so darn cute. I love me some jogger pants, you guys. You have no idea. But and I love the pockets. I love anything with pockets. I love it. I just love it. So I'm gonna wear these tomorrow for sure. So you guys will also see how those look tomorrow. And then after all that, me and my sister ate. Oh my god, you guys, the camera had died on me really quick. So anywho, I can't wait to try on those pants tomorrow. And then I also wanted to share that I got this the the day before yesterday and it's a little kitty back massager or just a massager and I cannot wait to get this tried on I tried it on my daughter already and I tried it on my partner already I rubbed their backs and everything they said it felt so good and I have yet to try it you guys they have not even offered to give me a back massage and I'm the one who bought it for myself so that they can stop complaining about using their hands and they have not even offered it's been two days since I bought it two days so We'll see how this goes, and thank you so much for watching today's vlog, and I hope you guys really enjoyed it, and oh my god, I have so many views that, to me, that's a lot, and I can't even, I can't even process it, like, even though it's not, it doesn't add to the subscribers I have, but the view count, I'm just like, holy snaps, and it's like, actually giving me motivation to just keep going and keep doing what I'm doing, and... I'm literally just having fun with everything that I'm doing. Like, like I really am, you guys. And I am just so happy. I have no words for it, to be honest. I really don't have any words. And thank you so much, you guys, for watching. And um, if you guys really do enjoy the videos I make, just go ahead and like and subscribe. You don't even have to like my videos. Just Goodness gracious. Once again, the camera died on me because I didn't charge it, to be honest. I just see if it would turn on again and it did and then let me talk for like that full minute anywho um i stopped talking um during the subscription part um but yeah as i was saying um i really appreciate all the view counts that i've been getting so far and obviously the people who subscribe to my channel i'm also very appreciative of you guys and um for those who are new to my channel if you guys want to know what my channel is going to be about just go to my first page i've only have like little videos but just go to my very first video and it'll like give you the touchdown base of, you know about me sort of um and just you know i would appreciate a subscribe <laughs> even though i'm camera i'm awkward about asking you guys to like subscribe and comment but yeah um if you guys really do enjoy my com uh my content so far just go ahead and subscribe and you know give it a thumbs up every now and then <laughs> uh sorry i'm a very awkward person so even through camera i'm gonna be very socially awkward so um that's gonna be the end of this vlog and thanks a lot to you guys i'll see you guys next time